Hey folks, I'm coming to you now from uh, North Carolina, Seymour Johnson Air Force Base, I understand. I've uh, been here about a week, saw some friends, and uh, did some modifications to my trailer. So I'm going to show you what I did. I know this is not going to be a very interesting video, but bear with me. So, I've added camera there, camera there, and then another one on the other side, and then I'm getting ready to add another one on the back. Um, part of it's for driving or backing, and part of it's uh, for surveillance. Um, I just have to get uh, wires now to run. I have to get 54 uh, or 8 50 foot uh, ethernet cables and I run them in the bus and to the trailer and that'd be it and then hopefully it works um, pretty nice area this area here that I'm in is uh, I'll show you is uh, this is powered and sewage and then there's a field right over there that I wasn't on the first day that was uh, that is dry camping so I was there one day and then I came over here it's uh, $25 a day not bad um, did some more modifications on my trailer well not yeah modifications okay I put um, uh, new leaf springs in uh, getting ready to put new uh, axles in that can handle uh, 10,000 pounds these leaf springs go with the new axles and I upgraded my tires the each tire can ha now handle 2,800 pounds so um, I don't plan on putting that much weight in it but I'm already uh, close to the limit I'm at uh, about 6,500 pounds and I'm getting ready to put all that cabinetry on the outside that's going to add weight to it and then I'm going to bring all that stuff from the inside outside uh, so I have more walking room on the inside and I also put uh, new um, U-bolts in it which are going to be for the new axles because the new axles are wide or are bigger round bigger diameter the three inch so I had to go with bigger uh, U-bolts um, not really much has happened with the bus. Did find out that I'm not going to be able to use the middle, the the um, the left wind, rear window because it's too close to the trailer when I do a left hand turn. So I may end up having to go through that middle window like I didn't want to do, but we'll see. Um, not really much else I'm gonna I've done to it. Um, the um, this side here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually lower that uh, uh, floor down on this this piece here. I'm gonna lower this down probably uh, I don't know how far I'll go but uh, I plan on maybe putting in a water tank here and I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side I'm just gonna make this deeper and uh, um, and then this stuff here will be stacked on top of the water tank and then uh, I'm not sure what size probably 30 gallon on either side um, that would take me up to 90 gallons for the uh, bus and then another 46 in the trailer. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to go that big, but that's what I'm looking at. Bus has been doing fantastic um, ever since I got the uh, wheel problem fixed, wheel hub fixed. It's doing really good. Uh, runs great. Everything is doing well on that. Uh, my new e-bike 
is doing fantastic other than uh, they're sending me a new battery because they think the battery is bad I can only go about um, 10 to 12 miles on the battery and they said that that's not right so they're sending me a new battery I don't have to I guess I don't have to send the new one the old one back but um, it, you're supposed to be able to on this uh, go up to 30 to 38 miles pedal assist but if I'm only getting um, uh, 10 to 12 with non pedal assist then I'm probably not going to get even close to 30 or 38 uh, even with pedal assist but anyhow um, that's about it uh, also bought these uh, locks here electronic locks is Bluetooth lo locks bought four of these uh, so that I can uh, strap uh, I have I got that's the remnants of my trailer for my e-bike uh, it's stored away and I just got to put those parts away but I bought an e uh, a trailer for the e-bike so I can go to a gas station and and carry my gas tanks for my um, inverter or for my uh, generators and I just installed a um, a remote start for this Honda EU 3000 IS they have they, this um, individual makes these and sells them on the web and uh, seems to be working great I can start it from inside the bus now without having to come down here and do the key thing. Well, that's really about all I got. I'm leaving here tomorrow, heading towards um, Atlantic Beach, North Carolina. I'm going to stay there for a couple days. And then I'll head to uh, uh, New Jersey, see a buddy of mine at uh, McGuire Air Force Base. Um, and then uh, I'll head into Maine. Anyhow. Appreciate you watching, and we'll see you in the next video.